What's up, Roughnecks? This is Pwn Source Rex, and of course we are looking at Alpha 18, but we're comparing it to Alpha 19 as far as the pistols are concerned today. We're going to look at the pistols because we now have a new release as of, I believe, yesterday that shows us what the new pistol looks like, or a different pistol. Not sure yet. We will find out that in the future. So let's look at our current pistols unmodified and modified and compare them against what we know to be to be coming or possibilities of coming in alpha 19 so let's get started so this is the rev the current revolver right here this is what it looks like it is you can see that it's got the smith and messin on it you can see the bullets in it does not currently revolve, but it does flip out and spin when you reload it. Fires, it jerks the, jerks the gun a little bit. Looks nice when it fires. It's a nice gun. I like using it a lot. It looks, it's just a good, it's just a good gun. So let's look at it when it's modified. This is with laser sight, two times scope. So that's what it looks like. Looking down it. That's what it looks like right there. If you were to look at it from a distance. Hold on. I'm spinning. I'm spinning. I don't know which way I'm going. I don't do this look a lot. All right, here we go. There we go. That's what it looks like. Boom. So let's go back this way. That's what it looks like from the side. Okay, now this is the one with the extended barrel. So it looks the same. The, the extended barrel does not have a uh, graphic yet. And this is what it looks like standard with no, no extra. Okay, so let's go on to the 9mm, which is our pistol that a lot of us use. Right here, this is what it looks like unmodded. It's a nice light gun. Feels nice. Doesn't have any writing on this side, but you can see the texture detail in the hand grip and on the side. So let's, uh... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I lost myself. I lost myself. I'm lost. There we go. Let's come back over here. Trying to, trying to mirror image walk is not working for me today, Roughneck. Oh, 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 oh. What am I doing? Here we go. Okay, this is the other side of the gun. Hold on. Looks like there might be some writing on this side. Nope, there's no writing. Oh, yep, there is. You can see it right there. It says mod. I can stop wiggling it for a second. 9mm. Warning. Okay, so that's got some nice little writing on it. Looks nice. It shoots quick. It's nice and light. We like it, so let's take a look at it modded a little bit. This is with the extended barrel, so the extended barrel on this model does not have a um, graphic either. And this is with the laser sight. Let's see, can we turn the laser sight on? I don't know. Yes, we can. Look at that. So the laser sight does come on. Wow, that's cool. So the laser sight, wow. Look at that. That's it. That's boom. So that's what it looks like. Now let's continue going to the silencer. Now this this can be compared to the new one because these are the mods that are on that are currently on the new one, I believe. Is the silencer, the laser pointer, and the scope. Now I'm going to show these pictures. You can see these pictures as we're going through. But yeah, that is what it looks like. As you can, as you can see, the fire is kind of like in it, in the middle of the silencer somewhere. Hopefully they'll fix that in the future. But yeah, that's what it looks like. Well, looking down the barrel, sort of. It's nice. It's probably my favorite weapon is the 9mm with a silencer right now. But yeah, that is, that's it. 
Now, when looking at these compared to the two new concepts, I think that the, the concept art of the Desert Eagle is the same as the Desert Vulture, only they finally finished it. Um, so I don't think we're going to get this clean one, but I'm not sure. We may have the clean version, and we may not. So, now, so we don't disappoint. I mean, you can't have a zombie movie video without killing a zombie. Let's see what we can do with these guns real quick. And let's do a... Whoop. What did I do? There we go. Let's uh, call in some fat Hawaiians. Oh, yeah. Let's call a bunch of them. Actually, we might just take this over to the... Whoa! Here they come. Whoa, ho, ho, ho. Oh, the fat Dennis Nedry Hawaiians. Oh, my goodness. Oh, we got to use the corridor. We're using the corridor. Come here. Ja Woodle's going to save us again. He always saves me with his corridors. He's going to do it. There we go. Come on. Look, here they come. This is, this is a modified corridor I was trying out for fun. To make him jump. Oh, there we go. The aiming is a little off on this thing because it has such a kick to it. You have to, you can't just keep firing because it just, for some reason, it just doesn't feel like it's aiming right. You've got to, you've got to actually take a second in between each shot, line it up. There we go. Let's switch it over to the 9mm. See, this one you can just keep firing. Love this gun. It's by far my favorite gun in the game, is the 9mm pistol with a silencer. Actually, this isn't even the one with the silencer. Let's go to the silencer one. There we go. <laughs> I... I love being able to shoot them like 10 times before they hit the ground. Oh! Yeah, that's right. I'm going to shoot you till your body disappears. All right, Roughnecks. That is what I think about the pistols and how they look currently compared to how they look in the future for Alpha 19. I think that's a nice comparison video to look at them. And hopefully they will continue to modify them and make them even better in the future because I am super excited for Alpha 19 and I think the rest of you are too. Make sure to subscribe to the channel and help me out with that 5,000 subscriber goal because that is how you get early access to the new uh, early releases, which is hopefully something that we'll be able to accomplish. I doubt we'll be able to accomplish it for Alpha 19, but maybe Alpha 20 if we work hard and we uh, come together and pull everybody in. So... You know, take a second and think about doing that. Down below is the Discord channel link. Come and join me on Discord. And also is the Patreon link. We're still looking for that first Roughneck to take the leap into that. So if uh, you feel like feeling like a diehard uh, Roughneck and being a diehard Roughneck, you know, click that link and check that out. Or just check it out just to see what's going on in the channel. Also, you know, leave a comment below and give me a thumbs up. Let me know how I'm doing with these videos. And if I don't see you in the comments below, I'll see you in the next video.